Hi, I'm Angelo, and this is Underrated Bodies. This week's Underrated Body, Steve Carell. I am the guy who needs to work out more. No, he doesn't. He hits the gym. I would venture to say that Steve Carell has one of the best male bodies in Hollywood. That's what she said. Or he said. I wouldn't describe Steve Carell's body as chiseled or defined, but that's not a bad thing. What are you even saying? You know how I would describe his body? Brawny, rugged, buff, burly, barrel chested. You would? Beefy. Jesus, God! Check out this clip from 1994 when Steve played Fabio at Second City. <laughs> yeah, look at that chest. Call me a pirate because I just found a treasure chest. It should come as no surprise that Steve Carell spent his whole childhood playing ice hockey. I've been playing hockey all my life. He was even his college team's goalie for four years. So that just speaks to the kind of body Steve Carell has. Really, he's a jock, and his body proves it. Steve Carell has the build of a guy you don't want to get into a bar fight with. The first thing you think of when you think of Steve Carell's body is probably hair. A lot of hair. Oh, we're gonna need more wax! But underneath all that hair is an underrated body. You wanna look good after this, man. Thanks, man. If Steve Carell shaved his hair and showcased his body, that would be like finding beautiful hardwood floors after ripping off old carpet. Oh, you fucker! That one little patch looks sexy, though. Does this look good? Yeah, it looks really good. This is not a good look for me! You know what is a good look for him? Thermals. Now, I know in this series we normally talk about shirtless bodies but I do want to give a shout out to Steve Carell wearing thermals. That's what she said? In season one of The Office, yeah, he probably wasn't in the best shape of his life. That's probably the meanest thing anyone's ever said to me. One could make the point that maybe he got a little bit chubby. What? Oh. Even though his midsection may be a little chubbier and even though his face is a little bit chubbier, his arms are still on point. In previous years, my fitness has been an issue. Steve Carell's biggest enemy is the wardrobe department. I know we remember him in Crazy Stupid Love for having bad fashion. And you're wearing a 44 when you should be wearing a 42 regular. But really, that's dogged him in every role he's had. The wardrobe department is always hiding his body under oversized polos and ill-fitting button-down shirts. You can see for yourself what a good tan and a well-fitted shirt can do. Steve Carell turned the movie The Way Way Back into The Way Way Jacked. I mean, check out the arm action we get when Steve lifts these bags out of the car and into the house. Look carefully here at his tricep flexing. I could watch a whole movie of just Steve Carell unpacking cars. And I know we've never gone below the waist yet in this series, but Steve Carell has definitely never skipped leg day. Are we on a farm? Because I see a couple calves. So there you have it. Steve Carell is one husky heartthrob.